And the Monroe County District Attorney's Office confirms Onondaga County District Attorney William Fitzpatrick will be reviewing Sandra Dorley's conduct. Dorley, the veteran DA for Monroe, requested the review after Officer Warren Camera video showed her disobeying and disrespecting a Webster police officer. Gio Battaglia joins us in studio now with more insight from a Rochester defense attorney about how investigations like Dorley's are generally handled. Gio. Teresa John Gilsonen says police officers have a lot of discretion regarding how they handle certain situations. And while we didn't talk about Dorley's investigation specifically, Gilsonen says he would hope a person's title or position wouldn't come into play during a police encounter. Now for speeding or use of a cell phone while driving, charges such as vehicle and traffic law violations are common. An excessive rate of speed, such as 55 miles per hour and a speed limit of 35, could possibly face reckless driving charges as well. Gilsonen adds if someone if somebody doesn't have a criminal record or if they are compliant, the decisions made right then and there by police sometimes allow people to get breaks. With an agency such as Webster Police as opposed to New York State Police, Gilsonen says there are different internal guidelines as to what discretion they have to do in certain situations. For example, in a, in a traffic situation, uh, We've all been pulled over, familiar experience, right? And there have been there are times when a, when a police officer can go back to his vehicle and access his database on his uh, you know in car computer, sees there's no criminal record, no traffic record, it's a one-off thing, and they give you a warning. That's a good example of of an officer using discretion. Now, as far as when body-worn camera footage is released, Gilsonen says it's helpful context, but adds, quote, just because we're seeing a moment in time doesn't mean we're getting the full picture of what happened, end quote.